Hey everyone, this is Beth. I am back in the bungalow today for bit number 24. Um, okay, so this is day seven of a self-imposed 28 day, what I'm calling boot camp, that uh, I'm to post one video uh, every 28 days, and this is day seven. Uh, so I admit, I had been skimming the surface trying to meet the goals. Um, and that in part, uh, it's kind of due to a responsibility that I'm kind of taking upon myself. Uh, there is a situation that I'm wanting to make sure that I can grab hold of. Um, I haven't been in control of that situation and I want to make sure that I can, uh, I can be there for someone who, um, who needs me to be there for them. So, uh, so this week, uh, that had taken the forefront, um, but now, I have scripted um, things and um, I've learned that I'm really not that set up to be scripted. So let's see how this goes. All right, let's back up though. I am currently in a state of limbo. Uh, let's start back in May of 2021. Uh, the amount of stress at work uh, that was brought on at work for me was way too much for my mentally challenged brain to take. Uh, after a particularly difficult psychiatrist session uh, my doctor asked if I was able to take leave I was so I did so immediately um, I've learned in the past that I am not one person that should kind of just sit and binge watch and wait for things to resolve so or even as I was waiting for the resolve I needed something to do um, a project um, so I started diving more into what I've always neglected, one of the talents that I've been told I always have, of my writing. Um, I had actually decided in April of 2021 that I wanted to write my 2020 memoir. Uh, I believe that 2020 was a, uh, I mean, <laughs> it's no secret that 2020 was an awful year. Uh, and but it was an important year, you know, no matter who you are um, 2020 was a very important year. So I decided that I was going to document it. It was gonna be really short. I wasn't That's all I was gonna write a 2020 memoir um, Well since I no longer saw myself uh, At that time when I was I was placed on, on uh, Disability I was placed on leave um, uh, and since I was no longer contributing to site, I never had, I, since I didn't have a job. <laughs> so still hard to say. Since I didn't have a job to go to every day, I needed to do something. Uh, so I kind of stepped up my writing and I added another book. And that was the Quick Start, the Beginner's Quick Start Guide to Journaling. I have a copy of it. It's going to be here. The Quick Start Guide to Journaling. So that is not the actual copy, um, but that is, is kind of the second book that I started. Um, but then, see I've gone off script. Um, anyway, that got too hard, as I've said in buffet before. So I moved on to my Quick Start, Quick, maybe I should change the name of it. Quick Start Guide to Journaling. So in that book, I go over the who, the what, the where, the when. Right now, it's at the editor. Um, yeah, so maybe I got to get used to this scripting thing. I do have the ideas beyond that, uh, beyond my 2020, 2020 memoir. I do have more ideas beyond that. I'd like to do a series on anxiety uh, that I, uh, it's going to be one book, one intro book where we talk about anxiety itself and some generic anxiety things and stuff that may or may not be as obvious to you depending on, you know, who you are and who's in your life. Um, and then I will write three more books. So I'll have the intro book and then I'll write three more books of the topics that I can find are most being searched at, uh, merch search, most searched for, so I can see what everyone out there is, is dealing with, and it's probably something I'm dealing with because my anxiety is high as well. Um, so anyways, I'll write three books after that, um, at least three books, depending on how the situation is wrapped up at work. 
um, I will either dive deeper into those or I will dive deeper into how I um, go forward with, with the company at a reduced stress level where I don't have to feel like I take these breaks. Anyways, moving on. It's more too much about me. Let's see here. Uh, okay, so if that, if that wasn't enough, right? If like trying to fix my old mental stuff and then trying to write the 2020 memoir and then doing the quick start journaling guide thing, I decided to start what you're watching right here. I start, decided to start a YouTube channel. Um, since I am diving in feet first, I didn't have much time to decide what my channel was gonna contain. Uh, I'm not too fond of making up things as I go, which is what I've been doing. Um, one calling I've been hearing over and over and over again, I've been just hearing it, I've been seeing it, I've been thinking about it, it just seems like it's been everywhere. I've been just everywhere I've seen uh, is journaling. Uh, I'm not I'm not really a creative person artistically, meaning like a drawing. I can't draw, I can't dress, <laughs> I can't, I, I, I just, I, I'm just not that stylistic, right? I can't put colors together. I can't match prints. Um, I don't know what shoes go with what. So I'm not that person. Uh, but journaling uh, is something that's really important. Um, uh, in fact, I am so bad at that stuff that I wanted to go into graphic design because I wanted to be a layout editor uh, when, I, when I grew up. I wanted to be a layout editor. And the major you have to get is the graphic design at that time that's what I was told that's what I thought was the graphic design uh, major and yeah you had to take art classes and you had to draw and Beth doesn't draw I do draw Beth at that time I'm gonna say that was 20 years ago so moving on um, let's see here my two creative claims to fame okay have been that I am the I was the editor-in-chief of the school high school newspaper my senior year the Purple Pulse, Go Warriors, and then scrapbooking. Uh, I also enjoyed scrapbooking. Uh, it was okay, and there was some really good stuff in my books, uh, but it was always so hard for me. I, I just didn't care as much about the creative details, so I was their perfect customer. I would buy all those kits, you know, that are like, tell you exactly what to do, and they cost a lot of money. Um, I just always wanted to get the memories down and out, and then I wanted to move on. Um, and that was okay. That should have been okay. Um, but I've always felt compelled to make my pages perfect and pretty. Um, and then maybe that's why I gave, I don't know why I stopped scrapbooking. And some of them were perfect and pretty. Some of them were. Uh, well, I think I may have found the middle ground. Uh, and uh, I'm trying to find a way to get really heavily into practical journaling. I'm talking office supplies, stuff you can get at Meyer. Amazon. I'm not stepping foot. There's nothing wrong with Michaels and Hobby Lobby, but I'm not step. I'm not stepping foot in. Uh, that was that was Alexa. That was Amazon. I call that one Amazon. Anyways, I'm not stepping foot in a Michaels. Um, so yeah, look for a new playlist. Look for a new channel. I don't know what that journaling thing is gonna become, um, but that's kind of what I've been working on. Uh, so that is my Sunday short. I don't know what to call it, but hey. It's day seven, I posted, I'm still on a roll. Uh, please, to see day eight, right when it comes out, uh, like my channel, um, subscribe to my channel. Of course you gotta like my channel. I like my channel, you should too. Anyways, please like this video, that helps me. Subcri subscribe to this video, that helps me. Right there is the bungalow. Please subscribe to Newsday Tuesday, where I put out a newsletter every Tuesday. And uh, go to bungalowimprint.com. That's bungalow imprint M. Imprint with an M like Mary. And subscribe to my newsletter. And then I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to try to do the, you know, descript it or whatever else. I'll see. Uh, it worked a little better. I think I went over what I wanted to get over. I read most of the words. So anyways, thank you very much for spending this time with me. And uh, so whenever I look down, I'm trying to find a little... I have, a, I have a watch, right? An Apple watch. And I'm trying to find out. Okay, so I should be able to, to stop. I'm able to stop the video using this, but it never stays open. So I want to be all cool. Like, hey guys, this is... Hey guys, from the...
bungalow basement and beyond. Today it was the bungalow. I am Beth and I'll see you tomorrow.